do have to commit to soil health in order to make it work. You gotta start somewhere, but you still gotta build your skills. The skill building is really important. That's the whole point of the yo-yo, is that everybody's had a yo-yo, everybody's used a yo-yo. You've all had one. This little loop, by the way, does not go over your finger. You have to make the loop by putting the string through that one. And now, when you put your finger in that slip knot, it tightens up and you've got control over this now. You have some control over your technique, what you're doing. Now you can throw it down without it flying off and going across the room. You've got control over it. That's the first thing you gotta learn. Well, that's the point of the yo-yo. This is one of the first tricks you gotta learn. It's how to get it to sleep at the bottom of the string and then come back. You can't learn that trick, you can't do other tricks. Things like rock the baby. It has to sleep at the end. Okay. See if we can do Eiffel Tower. Maybe, maybe not. Not too bad. If it doesn't stay at the end of the string to sleep, it's not gonna work. One of the first ones you'll learn is the walk the dog. Get it to sleep, let it pull across the carpet, the floor, whatever, that kind of thing. Another one that people have heard of is around the world. Again, it has to sleep at the end of the string. If you don't know that skill, you can't do the rest. The next thing is keep practicing, keep trying things. I'm left-handed. If you try to repeat me, about 77% of you are not gonna have success trying to do it this way with your left hand. A lot of people's left hand is just there for balance, okay? I can use my right hand because I'm forced to. But don't do things exactly the way that I do. Figure them out, okay? That's part of the practicing. This looping trick, there are several ways to do it. It's okay to do it different ways. It's totally fine. Figure out your way. The first trick I want people that are gonna lurk on so health if they're gonna use the yo-yo trick is how to get the yo-yo back when it stops. Because that's gonna happen. Something's gonna go wrong. You tried cover crops, they didn't grow. Now what? Well, you can stand here and wind it up. Ah, uh, yeah, okay. How long are you gonna do that? That takes a long time, okay? People don't wanna do that. The other way to get the yo-yo back is to learn a trick that brings it back. Way faster, cooler, and way easier. Now when the yo-yo dies on you in the middle of a trick, you've got a plan B. All you gotta do is give a little flip and you brought it back. Now you're ready to go again, instead of winding. Because when you first start yo-yo, if you don't learn that trick, you will be winding. That's what yo-yo is for the first two, three days is winding it until you get it to work. You don't wanna do that, you wanna play the yo-yo. So learn this trick on how to bring it back. That's what you wanna learn. Now, you at least have a trick that you can do to bring it back when it fails on you, when you're trying to do uh, other things and it does that. I knew that one because I can't do that trick. That was gonna happen. Okay, there we go. Now I got it back. Now I can go into loop the loops. I can go into other things. And when it fails, I've got that plan B. You have variability. You have different ideas and different ways to do things. These yo-yos are imperial style yo-yos, in case you needed to know that. They're thinner. These are butterfly style yo-yos that are wider, that are easier to do the string tricks on. These are easier for looping tricks or hand tricks, those types of things. So, but they're still yo-yos. You have all of these tools now, and you can do different tricks with all of them. And you can make them fit in different situations, in different areas. Like when your techno technology goes, goes out on you, what do you do? What's your plan B? Have a backup. If the string gets tied up on one of these, I'm gonna go to one of these. I can still do the same kind of thing. Make your skills adapt to what you're doing, but don't make you adapt to them. That's going too far. You've gone to the point where you're trying to be something you're not. Be who you are. Use the tools that you have that are common to you and make sense. Missed it. Need to practice that one. Now we got it. That's the point. Get it right and make it work. And don't forget the details matter.